Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So if you're new here, I normally make travel videos, travel advice videos, travel vlogs, but today I'm gonna to be going to a soft launch to a new restaurant that's opened up in Manchester. It opens up in a few days. Um, I'm not sure when you'll be seeing this video, but the restaurant will be open by the time you see it. So my auntie actually gets uh, tickets, you could say, to a lot of these different events. I've actually been to quite a few with her, and I just sort of thought I would vlog it because I haven't actually vlogged any of them. And the reason why they do these sorts of events as well is to promote these things on social media and Instagram so I just thought it would be a good thing to put it on my YouTube channel because I do lots of travel videos that are also foodie videos as well so I guess they two the two coincide you could say just that this time it's in my hometown or where I live at the moment um, in Manchester but I guess if you're traveling to Manchester then this is a cool restaurant you could try out so we're just gonna go see what it looks like and try the food and all that sort of thing I think it's a gin bar and there's like a distillery in the actual place so anyway let's get going because I'm running late Four years ago, Manchester Gin was created and now they have opened up a restaurant called Three Little Words. It combines a restaurant, bar and gin distillery all in the same venue. Do you know what three little words they're talking about? It's I love you. And being a gin distillery, they have a book full of beautiful cocktails. The cocktails are inspired by love and the different stages we go through with love. Lust, rapture, devotion, eternity, and ultimatum. I chose Into the Wild in the rapture section. I don't know if this means anything, like some sort of star sign or something, but I chose it because it sounded nice. We've just ordered a bunch of small dishes. We've got um, this scallop ceviche. Seared beef, courgette flour that looks a bit questionable here, chicken poppers, chicken lollipops, and some halloumi. Oh, and we've got some parsley chips here. So we've got like a parsley dip with these chips. And I'm gonna try this ceviche scallop. So we've got apples in here. Apples? How am I gonna get these apples? Each other's. So we've got a classic sticky toffee pudding here, which is actually from the Lake District. And then we've got a Manchester tart right here and here. <laughs> Manchester tart has banana, custard, strawberry, jam, and coconut on the top. So let's try both of them. Let's give this one a go. This is my favourite dessert. I'm doing a whole lot. Oh my god, that melts in your mouth. Okay, let's do this one now. Mm, that is really good. I've never had that before. like the gin making section <laughs> so I assume you can get groups and stuff like that that you can come in here with and you can um, make your own gin or see how it happens with all these things here I assume all these sort of things this here is what you can infuse it with yeah so you just sell your own and you put your own tablets in design your own gin yeah oh. so when you're making it here you actually take home a bottle of gin based on whatever you want to put in it Go. So we just finished our delicious dinner at Three Little Words and it was kind of like a mix of modern British food, wasn't it? Yeah. Um, my favourite dish would have been the seared beef actually and I don't really like beef all that much 
What was yours? Um, I don't know. I'm surprised by the chicken actually because I normally don't go for chicken. I don't normally go for nice. chicken. I don't know, I didn't really like the chicken. That was the only one that I wasn't fussed by. <laughs> it, was, it wasn't hot. It was sweet. It was sweet. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to think what else we had. Actually, I love the halloumi. The halloumi was Yeah, I always like halloumi. But we had a collection of score plates, but you can have like a score plate as a starter and you can have a main. larger plate as a main, but we just went for a collection. We only had to pay for our drinks because Lee got invited, well, you got chosen. Applied. applied for yeah. <laughs> so we didn't have to pay for the food so that was good because it came to like 86 quid or something but we only had to pay about 40 but yeah overall good experience definitely, definitely. recommend it good really atmosphere good atmosphere and really nice inside and I think you can do gin making classes in there as well I'll link it below if I find it on the website. So that's the end of the video everyone. I hope you enjoyed watching. I hope you enjoyed this different kind of content on my channel or if you're new here I hope you enjoyed it anyway. Make sure you go and check out all my other videos about travel and stuff. Hopefully we'll be doing a lot more videos like this and doing a lot more videos like this in Manchester as well and exploring Manchester and trying different restaurants in Manchester and all that sort of thing. And make sure you go and check out Three Little Words because it's great to be supporting local companies and local restaurants and local people. Make sure you comment below if you want to see more content like this and give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye! Oh, don't forget to subscribe, obviously.